know about me, I used to be a huge underachiever, but through obsessive self-improvement, I found my success. Earned a college scholarship, played for my national futsal team, a YouTube channel with over 100 million views. I've helped players worldwide, and I'd love to help you improve faster and achieve more. I've been doing a lot of shooting videos this week, and I think this is the most important video. And today I wanted to talk about what do you do when you miss a shot? Because all these things we're talking about, shooting with power, accuracy, scoring goals, it doesn't matter if you don't get value out of your missed shots. And what do I mean by that? I mean, when I shoot the ball and I miss, you can either do what most people do, and that is get frustrated, get upset, never want to take a shot again, or you can actually analyze what happened, and by doing that, you can actually improve your shooting much quicker. So if you want to be a great shooter, you need to analyze every single shot. So for example, that's a decent shot. But if I hit the ball and I miss the net, I have to ask myself why. Don't just get upset, ask why. Okay, so if I curled it and I keep scoring goals, I can't miss. <clears throat> for example, if I curled it and I miss the shot, okay, instead of just getting pissed and frustrated with yourself, ask yourself why. Why did I miss this shot? Okay, so first of all, I can see right now, I missed the shot because when I hit it, my body opened up this way too much. I needed to stay more like this. I need to follow through more towards the net and not like that. And if you can learn to analyze every single shot, especially the ones you miss, you're gonna become a lot better at shooting. Another example, if I'm going to get a shot and I hit it over the net, okay, I have to ask why did it go over the net? Okay, I tried to hit it too hard or I hit too low on the ball. Okay, you need to analyze all these things. And if you can do that, rather than doing what most people do, just get upset with themselves, then you can learn to become a better shooter so much faster. Because actually, every bad shot is a good thing. Okay, like I said, I can't miss. Because I've taken the time to think about every shot. And there you go. What, one thing I do want to say, and this is huge, this is something that I always try to do, especially when I'm practicing, if I miss a certain type of shot, so for example, if I come out here and I pull that one wide. If you like this content, check out the Soccer Success Planner. You can download it for free. There's a link in the description below. And for advanced training, check out the online soccer account. I make a mental note. I never, I never want to do that again for the rest of the session. Or if I know that's like one of my usual tendencies, I always shoot and it pulls that way. I make a mental note. I'm never going to do that again. I would much rather in that same situation, I would much rather put it right down the middle and get it on net than pull it to that side where I always keep making the same mistake. So what I'm trying to get at there is you don't want to make the same mistakes again and again. You have to learn from your mistakes. And if you can get in that habit of learning, correcting, getting outside of yourself and actually looking at what you're doing rather than just, like I said, being upset, getting frustrated, you're going to improve so much faster. The other thing I want to talk about is your mentality after you miss a shot or miss a chance. So let's say, for example, how many times has it happened that easy ball comes across the net and it's a wide open net and somehow you manage to miss it. Okay, what happens to most players in that situation? They're done. They're not going to get another shot for the rest of the game. What you need to do is go searching for that next opportunity right away. You must believe that the next chance you can score and you must want that next chance. Most players, as soon as that happens, Let's say, for example, they missed that easy tap in or they took a shot and they missed and everyone yelled at them, they will hide. Every time they get an opportunity again, they will pass the ball away or they'll be wide open in front of the net and they won't even ask for the ball. They won't even want the ball because they're afraid of missing. Okay, if you missed a chance, have the mentality that next chance I'm going to get it. Even if you miss five in a row, the sixth one, you're going to get it. You have to have that mentality that even though I've missed all my chances today, I can score the next one. Okay, so that's what I want to talk about today, guys. Missing opportunities, how do you react? Everyone misses chances, everyone misses shots. What's important is how do you react and how do you get value from that experience? Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you found it valuable. Like I said, this is probably the most important shooting tutorial that I've done. So you take this information and please, please actually use it. Please give me a thumbs up. Please comment below if you have any questions. And please share this video with your friends and teammates. If you appreciate my videos, please support me on Patreon. I'll talk to you soon.
If you like this content, check out the Soccer Success Planner. You can download it for free. There's a link in the description below. And for advanced training, check out the Online Soccer Academy.